Good East positioning of the sun, everybody. The name is Wolfhanger. Welcome back to another episode of the Hunger Games Simulator. Last time we did BattleBots, as suggested by a BattleBots meme channel. This time around, as suggested by my pop tart on YouTube, we are doing Resident Evil characters. I know nothing about this horror game franchise. I don't tend to know a lot about many scary things. However, I will say, Albert Wesker did look cool as all hell in Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3. And Carl Heisenberg looks like, looks like he's just having the time of his life. So I'm honestly gonna, going to root for those two. And with our listing cast settled out of the way, let's proceed. As a tribute stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. William runs away. Mr. X gathers as much food as he can. Same with Wesker. Claire runs away. Leon snatches a pair of sighs. Sherry kills Carl with a hatchet. Damn you, Sherry! Fuck you. Carlos runs away. Louise takes a spear from inside the cornucopia. Jack Krauser, or yeah, Jack K, realizes it, grabs a backpack, not realizing it's empty. She runs away from the cornucopia. Ada rips a mace out of Ashley's hands. Evelyn receives a, receives a trident from inside the cornucopia. Chris and Rose run away. Salazar receives a trident from inside the cornucopia. Mother Miranda and Barry fight for a bag. Barry gives up and retreats. Hunk takes a handful of throwing knives. Jill grabs a sword. Ethan takes a sickle from inside the cornucopia. Jack Baker runs away. Nemesis falls into a pit and dies. Wow. Jill receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. Louise falls into a pit and dies. William is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Claire injures herself. Leon practices, practices his archery. Ada begs for Evelyn to kill her. She refuses keeping Ada alive. Barry bleeds out due to untreated injuries. Wesker, Hunk, and Ashley hunt for other tributes. Mr. X sprains his ankle running away from Shiva. Salazar receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Ethan goes hunting. Mother Miranda attacks Sherry, but he man she manages to escape. Jack Baker tends to Carlo's wounds. Chris, Rose, and Jack Krauser hunt for other tributes. Four cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Carl from District 12, Nemesis from District 9, Luis from District 5, and Barry from District 4. With that said and done, no district is taken out of play, but we are down to the top 20 survivors. Let's proceed. Night 1. Mother Miranda defeats Evelyn in a fight but spares her life. Salazar unknowingly eats toxic berries. Chris questions his sanity. Sherry defeats Hunk in a fight but spares his life. Carlos looks at the night sky. Leon climbs a tree to rest. Jack Krauser quietly hums. Mr. X begs for Claire to kill him. She refuses keeping Mr. X alive. Shiva sees a fire but stays hidden. Rose destroys Ada supplies that he's asleep. 100% <laughs> one she's I've played that game a lot. Rose destroys Ada supplies that she's asleep. William receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. Jack Baker cries himself to sleep. Ashley lets Jill into her shelter. Wesker receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Ethan questions his sanity. Okay, Steam, I get it. Mr. X injures himself. Jack Baker practices practices archery. Ada begs for Sherry to kill her. He refuses keeping Ada alive. Shiva, William, Jill, Claire, and Wesker hunt for other tributes. Ethan, Chris, Jack, Krauser, and Carlos hunt for other tributes. Rose chases Mother Miranda. Evelyn stalks Hunk. And Leon stalks Ashley. Okay, Steam. I get it. One cannon shot can be heard in the distance, and it's Salazar from District 9. Actually, District 9 is taken out of play with that, so they're completely out, and we are down to the top 19 survivors. Proceed. Chris passes out from exhaustion. Leon tries to treat his infection. Shiva thinks about home. Jill quietly hums. Mr. X convinces Evelyn to snuggle with him. Ada attempts to start a fire, but is unsuccessful. Rose questions her sanity. Wesker stays awake all night. Jack Krauser is unable to start a fire and sleeps without warmth. Ethan tends to his wounds. Hunk begs for William to kill him. He, re he refuses keeping Hunk alive. Ashley receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Mother Miranda kills Claire while she's sleeping. Jack Baker looks at the night sky. Carlos destroys Sherry's supplies while she's asleep. Day 3. Leon, Chris, and Wester track down and kill Shiva. Carlos questions his sanity. Ethan is pricked by thorns of picking berries. Jill discovers a cave. William and Rose were together that day. Mr. X chases Ada. Jack Krauser receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Evelyn overhears Jack Baker and Hunk talking in the distance. Ashley sets an explosive off, killing off Mother Miranda. Sherry questions her sanity. Three cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Claire from District 2, Shiva from District 11, and Mar Mother Miranda from District 8. With that being said and done, District 9 is the only district that is still out of play, but we are down to the top 16 survivors. So, William, Chris, and Jack Krauser cheerfully sing songs together as Carlos quietly hums. Jill tends to Evelyn's wounds. 
Ethan attempts to fire, but is unsuccessful. Jack Baker begs for Mr. X to kill him. He refuses keeping Jack Baker alive. Ada fends Leon, Wesker, and Rose away from her fire. Hunk and Sherry run into each other and decide to choose for the night. Ashley starts a fire. Day four. Jack Krauser overpowers Will overhears William and Hunk talking in the distance. Sherry falls into a frozen lake and drowns. Rose sprains her ankle, running away from Ethan. Leon camouflages himself in the bushes. Ada questions her sanity. Ashley questions her sanity. Evelyn tends to Wesker's wounds. Jack Baker searches for firewood. Mr. X searches for a water source. Jill steals from Chris while he isn't looking. Carlos thinks about home. One cannon shot can be heard in the distance. Sherry from District 6. With that, again, District 9 is still the only district completely out of play, and we're down to the top 15 survivors. Mr. X tends to Chris's wounds. Carlos tries to treat his infection. Jack Baker convinces Ada to snuggle with him. Jack Krauser and Wesker hold hands. Ashley strangles Evelyn with a rope. Rose shoots an arrow into Jill's head. William cooks his food before putting his fire out. Hunk quietly hums. Ethan and Leon huddle for warmth. Rose receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. William attacks Jack Krauser, but he manages to escape. The same events happen with Wesker and Ethan. Carlos tries to sleep through the entire day. Chris and Hunk talk to hunt for other tributes. Mr. X sees smoke rising in the distance, but decides not to investigate. Jack Baker practices his archery. Ashley chases Ada and Leon fishes. Two cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Evelyn from District 11 and Jill from District 1. With that, districts District 9 and 11 are completely out of play. Keep the jokes to yourself, and we're down to 13 survivors left standing. Wesker unknowingly eats toxic berries. Damn it, Wesker. It's fine. We got more episodes until 25. I can get my two in there. Or get one in there. Jack Baker goes to sleep. Leon, Hunk, Ashley, and Chris tell each other ghost stories light in the mood. Rose dies at dissentiary. Okay, so that's 12. No, that's 11. Ethan, Mr. X, and Ada get into a fight. Ada triumphantly kills them both. Nine. Carlos, William, and Jack Krausler sleep in shifts. The feast, the corner cobies, the plants, food supplies, weapons, and memoirs from Chibi's families. Hunk, Chris, William, Carlos, Jack Baker, Ada all decide not to go to the feast. Leon stabs Ashley in the back with the trident, and Jack Krauser decides not to go to the feast. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight survivors left standing. Day six. Jack Baker dies of dissentiary. Hunk, Ada, and Chris successfully ambush and kill William, Carlos, and Jack Krauser. Leon decides to explore the arena. Okay, never mind. Four survivors left standing. We're down to our final four already. Nine cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Wesker from District 7. Rose from District 3. Ethan from District 3. Mr. X from District 12. Ashley from District 8. Jack Baker from District 10. William from District 6. Carlos from District 5. And Jack Krauser from District 10. With that, Districts 3, 5, 6, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12 are completely out of play. As we are down to our top five survivors, and Ada Wong approaching that kill record. Leon stays awake all night. Ada receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Chris quietly hums, and Hunk goes to sleep. Hunk receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Leon searches for firewood. Chris and Ada work together for the day. No cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Leon and Hunk huddle for warmth. Ada climbs the tree to rest. Chris tries to treat his infection. Ada begs for Chris to kill her. She refuses to keeping Ada alive. Hunk constructs a shack, and Leon falls into a pit and dies. One cannon shot can be heard in the distance, and it's Leon from District 1. With that, Districts 1, 3, 5, 6, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12 are completely out, and we are down to our top three survivors. Will it be Chris Redfield, Ada Wong, or Hunk? Ada and Chris run into, a, run into each other and decide truth for the night. Hunk sets up camp for the night. Ada makes a slingshot. Hunk bashes Chris's head in with a mace. One cannon shot can be heard in the distance, and it's Chris from District 2. We're down to our final two as Districts 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12 are completely out of play. Will it be Ada Wong or Hunk, who is the winner of our Resident Evil Hunger Games? Ada accidentally steps on a landmine. The winner is Hunk from District 7. Well, there you have it, folks. Our eighth episode winner, Hunk, is ready for the cha championship. And actually, was there even a chance for a G name to win? K N L B. Oh, look at that! The one, the first time in a while, 
there was a G. We don't have a G name, so we can't continue the G trend. But anyways, yes. To review the placements in twenty fourth and twenty fourth, Carl Heisenberg, and twenty third, Nemesis T Type, and twenty second, Luis Serra, and twenty first, Barry Burton, and twentieth, Ramon Salazar, and nineteenth, Claire Redfield, and eighteenth, Shiva Alomar. And 17th with one kill, Mother Miranda. And 16th with one kill, Sherry Birkin. And 15th, Evelyn Marcus. And 14th, Jill Valentine. And 13th with one kill, Albert Wesker. And 12th with one kill, Rosemary Winters. And 11th, Ethan Winters. And 10th, Mr. X. And 9th with two kills, Ashley Graham. In 8th place, Jack Baker. In 7th, William Birkin. In 6th, Carlos Oliveira. In 5th, Jack Cruiser, and fourth with two kills, Leon Kennedy, and third with four kills, Chris Redfield, and second with five kills, Ada Wong, and the winner with four kills, Hunk. It was a little longer than average. District placements in 12th, 9, and 11th, 11, and 10th, 3, and 9th, 12, and 8th, 8, and 7th, 6, and 6th, 5, and 5th, 10, and 4th, 1, and 3rd, two in fourth in second four in first seven there we go okay and that will conclude it for a hunger game simulator episode thank thank once again to my pop tart for suggesting the episode and next time we are going to continue our series tradition and next episode will be every person who got last place in season four except for our champions episode but that is for next time i will end this time by saying what i normally do and that i bid you all a good west positioning lesson everybody see you all next time